Okay, most likely the final 16th note strumming pattern we're going to do. Tons of upstrokes, very easy to get lost. So pay very close attention. Concentrate, concentrate, concentrate. So, here we go at 40. Use Guitar Pro if you need it. Probably a good idea to start with that. Uh, here we go. 1 E and a 2 E and. 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a 4 E and a 1 Just do 70. One, two, three, four. One. Wrong chord at the end. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. Two, count of three, sixty to start this time. One, two, three. One twenty. One, two, three. before next week send a video as soon as you got that and for the chord theory so moving forward with the suspended chords so learn these shapes or like play each bar a few times just pay attention to how each shape looks And you're going to follow the Roman numerals and write all these again starting on the A string and then do the same thing starting on the D string, the G string, and the B string and then do the same thing for the suspended fours. <laughs> I 
like that. I should have turned my speaker down. Right at the last arpeggio. All right. Um, but yeah. Get comfortable with those and then start moving them all up string by string by string. All right. Any questions come up, let me know. I'll see you next week.